Hey everyone, it's Sam here and today I have a brand new collection to share with you. This is my new triple tier slider card. It is a style that's been around before and I have shared it many years ago on my channel. But if you like the dies to do all the work for you, then I think you're really going to like it. You can double it up so you can turn it into a big showstopper. And I've launched it with three new stamp and die sets. You've got a sports theme, but there's also like an all occasions, butterflies, balloons and presents. So there's something for everybody here. There's a nice paper pad in there as well. So let's have a closer look at this collection. So I've got seven new products here to show you. So first of all, we'll start off with the paper pads. So this is out and about. It's an A5 paper pack. You get four each of six designs. It's 190 GSM. And I'll just show you the designs here. So you've got the grass there with the stripes. You've got this lovely scene. So, you know, these are going to work across other cards, not just the sports theme. Love that scene, though. You've got the sky. This one's one of my favourites with the racetrack there. You've then got another nice scene. And then you've got the one with the grass and the sky there. So if you like having your backgrounds all done for you, then you're gonna enjoy this paper pack. Next, I've got something that I think a lot of you are gonna like and use a lot because it's something that I have, well, because it's something that's been mentioned and there's been times during my Facebook lives where I've been like, oh, this would be handy to have and it's a sports net but it can be any kind of net so i've said in a lot of my videos obviously a fishing net sports net but all different kinds of sports nets you've got tennis badminton um I, there's probably loads more that i don't know about it could be like fishnet tights maybe you're doing like a burlesque style card you could also cut this in maybe like a silver and it could be like a cage and then maybe you could have like a little rabbit in there or you know or other pets and animals and things like that maybe a zoo and you could have the animals behind it so i think it's going to work for lots of things it's a really nice size it's five by seven simple die but one that i think is going to get used a lot so i'm so glad i've got this and i've already done a couple of really nice card samples showing you how to use this one then i've got the three stamp and die sets so we've got so sporty so you've got your runner there your golfer your footballer and then elements to go with each of those sports and you've also got some nice sentiments there have a ball on your birthday you are a winner have a terrific day and then you've got the run 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 with the sports number there this one, get moving. So you've got your cyclist, you've got your motorbike and you've got your sports car. You've also got a male and female that you can pop in the sports car if you want. And then you've got the steering wheel, you've got a tyre, you've got the helmet. And then you've got sentiments, have a wheelie, great time. You've got the number plate there, style just for you. Then you've got have a spectacular day and then time to rev up some fun. And then you can see all these movement stamps as well in there, which is just great to kind of stamp around them and on the backgrounds. And then this one here, so not sports related. So if you're not into any of that, we've got this one here, which is called Surprise. And you've got your kind of cascade of butterflies, the presents, and then the balloons, which I absolutely love. And then the sentiments, hope your birthday is an explosion of fun, time to celebrate and surprise. And you've got a few extras here. You've got the little streamers, which are always handy. A couple of extra balloons, extra butterflies, and extra presents there as well. Then a fun pun sentiment set. It wouldn't be a collection without one. I've got so many now and I just absolutely love doing these. This one's called Moving Along. So you've got it's party time. Hope your birthday is overrun with fun. I like her a lot. <laughs> that one. He shoots, he scores. Goal. Racing by to say hi. Let's celebrate you. You better start slowing down. Wishing you lots of love on your birthday. Happy birthday, champ reach for the sky, hope you have a wheelie great day, time to hit the road and another year speeds by. And these again, the same fonts and they're going to mix and match and coordinate with other sentiments as well. And then the main mechanism. So this is the new 5x7 triple tier slider card die set. There is a lot of dies in this one. You've got everything you need to make your triple slider, but you can also double the triple slider and it will create a very long card, which I have a few samples to share showing you how to do that one. So I think a lot of you are going to enjoy it, especially if you want to really pull it out and create like a big scene cover it in photos there's so many wonderful things you can do with this but you also don't have to have it as a triple you can just have it as a double and then double up the double yeah 
I'm sure we're going to get creative with this during the Facebook Lives and some of you are probably going to come up with some really cool ideas and fun ways to use it. But everything is there to make it. Like I said, I have done these styles before. I've got them on my channel. But if you like the dies to do all the work for you, then this is the die set. You've got your two tracks there. You've got your cases to wrap each tier. And then these are all your mats and layers, your pull tag. And then this is the track to help everything slide along. 13 dies and like I said that's a 5 by 7 size so you will need a larger die machine for this one. So let's have a look at the lovely samples. So here are some of the samples. There are more so check out the listing on Craft Stash under all the products and you'll see them there but also if you're on Facebook head over to Mixed Up Craft and you'll see them under the Albums tab, Triple Tier Slider and I'll also be adding all of these onto my website as well onto the blog. Um, along the sidebar you'll be able to see all my collections and I'm going to have all of the photos of the samples there. I am kind of backdating it as well so it is a bit of a project but they will be there if you don't see them straight away they will be coming up. These are just some like I said of the wonderful samples there's a mix of mine and Gemma's here so for example this one here Gemma's made using the sports car and you can see how it all pulls out from the side but what I love that she's done here she's added an extra sliding element Gemma's added a stand onto the back of those ones there and that's it in a landscape orientation or you can have it in portrait so I've done this one here using the balloons and as you pull up each of the tiers you can see it reveals a different panel Love this, love the balloons. I've done that decoupage, which I'm a little bit obsessed with at the moment. I've been doing it on quite a few different cards. And then that all folds down. It's a five by seven top fold. So it can be displayed like so, but it can also be displayed open as well. There is a huge monster one here. Gemma's done the one here with the runner. So she's doubled up the triple, which I think looks fantastic. I think I'm going to be using this during one of my mix and matches. I want to do all of like the rooftops and then maybe a festive scene and Santa on his sleigh. I think it will look wonderful. That's where I'm going with this one at the moment, but I'm sure lots of you have got ideas already. And then I did this version of a football one as a triple and it's got the, the net there detail. The other way that you can use that net is this is the side panel showstopper die set. I've just not added that extra score line on the back and I've created this stepper and I've put the net behind and I just love this. I think it's brilliant. Really, really good fun. Um, so that's your triple ones. Then you've got this one's nice. This is just like a little single on the side. You can see how the cyclist looks there. And then I did this one here with the motorcyclist. Hey, you better start slowing down. You can see the papers there. This one, Gemma's done, the golfer. Love that. I think that's really cool. So clever. It's party time. Have a terrific day. Um, we've got the balloons one here. We've got the butterflies here. And then I did this little simple one as well, using the balloons and the papers. I used the house. That's from an older set. And I used it on a little wobbler. And I just, I love that. I think that's so cute. So yeah, there are, like I said, just some of the samples and what this die set does. I'm really excited for this one. I really have a passion for my range and what I give to you guys. So I hope that you like this one too. And if you know me now, you know I'll be sharing a lot more inspiration during my Friday mix and matches. We have lots of fun over there. I know not everybody's on Facebook, but if you are on Facebook, head over to Mix Up Craft on a Friday at 10 a.m. I go live and we mix and match old and new made to surprise products. And we have such a laugh and we create some really unusual cards. Sometimes they don't maybe always work, but nine times out of 10, they're pretty spectacular. So yeah, head over there. It's linked in the description box below. So I will be live today over on Craft Stash at 12.30 uh, BST. And I'll be doing two new demos using, I think I'm going to be using the balloons and the golfer. So if you want to catch me live over there, you can. And make sure you're subscribed to Made to Surprise on YouTube. So that's where I'll be uploading all of the tutorial of my samples here. And Gemma, who's my design team, who's done a lot of these as well. Her YouTube channel is Gemma Lee Crafts and she does a few tutorial uploads as well. So head over there. But all this new products available now on Craft Stash. So it'll be linked individually in the description box below. I'll link the live as well for today. So if you're watching this after 12.30 or later on this evening or the next day, the next week, you can click on it and watch the replay. And I think that's everything. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on future videos on this channel. And yeah, I'll be back again very soon with more tutorials. Take care, everyone. Bye.